Hello guys, and I know I don't make videos or anything like that on my channel, and if you're coming to my channel for th for this purpose of this video, then welcome. Um, I do stream, and I do tend to try and stream other games, a lot of Rust, but I'm kind of getting back into the BDO area. I just wanted to kind of make a video on how I make my money, and how you could possibly, depending on how well you can do it, make at least depending on how many you make and sell to the marketplace you could make about 20 to about 25 million a day but that's just with one product and if you've got a good setup with your nodes for example or you have a decent energy and contribution and you're farming for yourself as well then this would be a decent guide for you if you're kind of new and you're not really out there grindy grindy with the big guys um, I don't go out and grind in the big areas with the big lads my AP is 174 and you know I just have fun at the Nagas and just farm for an hour or two and I make about 7 mil maybe about 7 to 10 mil an hour there um, kind of find life scaling more better than uh, farming I know farming and grinding would be a hell of a lot better more passive income and everything like that but really what you want to do is make good feed good feed is a great source of income it still is and at the moment I have don't believe I've got any on the market but I have got some to upload on the market um, yeah I haven't got any on the market at the moment I'm just trying to get rid of all my other crap um, and that's, I find, I'm finding that a pretty decent source of income and if you're able to cook around one second to about three seconds you'd be fine because you'd be able to mass produce it and um, I'm not great with the editing, but I'll try and put some uh, links in the description for where you can get the cooking recipes for this so it's easier for you to learn and I'll pinpoint some of the areas locations now. So what you're going to want to do is here you see hey it's a Heidel, Heidel, Heidel. He's what I've come left to um Ali Jandro's farm and just come a little bit more left to about these trees here and just up here. You want to go here and you will find a crap ton of sheep and mountain goats. There's loads there so you don't need to fight over the spot to farm it. And you just want to farm there and get your lamb meat. Which is great because that's what you're going to use for your number one in your materials. So you're going to want to collect lamb meat. Which is good. And of course if you over, you know, like you're getting way too much or you're getting more than you're actually using, you could just sell it on the marketplace or stock it up for another day. And what you're going to want to do as well is obviously you can buy pretty much all the rest of the materials in the shop. But you're also going to want to buy a decent source of fish, which is, I'm not actually, I haven't got any at the moment apart from this um, scorpion fish. You can buy this on the marketplace or if you really are good at um fishing yourself you could sit here and just AFK fish and get a decent amount of fish or you can you know go even further out and you know into the ocean and get better fish so that's another good source of um, fish but if not like me I don't bother with fishing I just go straight to the marketplace buy it on the marketplace and let's have a look materials I bet yeah there's gonna be some seeds so yeah, you're going to want to buy all the potatoes or wheat or whatever you want. But you want to go to fish and you just want to look for a decent one that has like, hey, 500 hair. You could just buy all of that. That's not going to cost, well, I can't actually um, off ask to buy it. Find out the set price of 600 there. Um, you know, just find whatever they've got loads of stock in. And just purchase a whole bunch of that because you're going to go through your fish like wildfire. Um, and now I'm pretty sure I should be able to um, just bring up a cooking list I'm pretty sure you should be able to see it um, good feed uh, good pet feed so you're gonna need six pork this 
doesn't mean just pork. You can use the lamb, like I said, any kind of meat. You're going to want to use either one fresh fish, so it's just caught from the ocean, or two times dried fish. Then you're going to want three mineral water and four grain flour. So grain flour is... Oh, I didn't mean to open that. Grain flour is going to be potato, um, corn, um, stuff like that. Um, wheat, you can grind it down and make flour. Which is, I use potato flour because I've got a... Well, compared to other YouTubers out there, they've got, they've got tremendous amounts. But for me, that's quite a lot. I've got 1,800 potatoes. And I use that for bears and stuff like that. Um... And what you're going to do, you're just going to want to make good feed. Let's have a look on the marketplace. Uh, good feed. There we go. Sells for 1100 I know there's a lot on there, but people do buy it. I'm always selling mine. And every time you put 500 on, it's going to sell for about 11 uh, mil. Some, especially if someone buys all of it, or if it all goes in one purchase, or something like that, you know. Like, sometimes that'll go in little bits, sometimes that'll sell at, like, you know, someone will come and buy, like, 50, and then someone will come and buy another 50, or sometimes that'll go at, like, 100. Um, but it all adds up to a meal, and, it, like I say, if you mass produce and you upload, what, 2,000 good feed, that's what, two, uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, that's 20 mil just there. And if you got, like, energy like me, I can tell you now, I normally go out and farm all the stuff I need to for that throughout the day. So I use a day's worth of energy, which is my energy regenerates quick, pretty quick. Or if you're even cooler and you've got a bed in your little house, you can sleep on that and your energy recovers a little bit faster. But I'm currently using this uh, cam camus levis sub there, something blessing, and it increases my energy recovery by two plus. So I get a faster energy, but um. Yeah, and you just want to go out and farm that lamb, get as much as possible. The rest of the materials you can get off the marketplace, um, but that lamb is what you definitely want to go and get. Get loads of that. Put about, two, gather about two thousand within a day, or even more if you can with your energy. If you've got higher energy than me, then well done. You can gather a lot of lamb, but if you have less energy or just around the same energy as me you're going to gather about 600 lamb a run and of course you're going to want to wear if you've got um pearl items then you're going to want to wear uh the treant camouflage armor for the gathering boost it gives you of course you're going to also want to um where is it uh where where is it is it this one no, that's fishes. Oh no, I'm wearing a duh. You want to wear some gatherer clothes just to get that extra gathering ability. Plus the XP is, you know, nice as well. And I would recommend being at least professional gatherer for a better outcome. But you can start at any gathering you wish to. Um, it's kind of a full guide. And then of course what you're going to definitely, definitely want to do is in your city you're going to start wanting to produce uh, advanced cooking utensils which are pretty easy to do so here you can see um, they take polished stone which is you grind down rough stone you're going to want some usable scantling which is chopping logs you're going to want some melted iron shards you're going to get melt you can get iron ore from just mining rocks and gathering rough stone so that's all right and then blackstone powder, I do believe you can crush down crystals and stuff like that to get blackstone powder. Uh, you can get quite a lot of that pretty easy. And then you can just want to craft as many as possible. So, start doing that now. And obviously in your resident, you're going to want to place them down. And if you've got decent cooking stuff, so if you've got, you know, like the cooking cape and, cape and you've got decent cooking clothes you know like, like cooking time minus three percent and you've got if you got better than me but i just use this because i was cheap on the marketplace it, it increases by 0.7 percent seconds you'll be cooking at around about three to one seconds depending on what you've got if you're cooking higher than that it's no bother you'll still produce you know 
the ingredient or the product good feed and it's always handy because you can always use it yourself um, but yeah if you're personally watching this just just to make some money on the marketplace you want to be uploading at l making at least about 2000 and you that will sell within seconds minutes you know just uh, keep an eye on your marketplace your emails as you can see or your mail see I've sold some earlier and they're gone I've already gathered the money but with collecting rough stone you want to go anywhere you want I know that there's a much better place in the desert I just can't be bothered to run all the way over there I'd rather just come up here and farm in this area and I've been up here for about 10 20 minutes now or not even that about 15 minutes and I've already gathered all of this 300 rough stone and I've still got 80 80 energy left you know so you get I, I get a decent amount out over here um, so yeah that's kind of my guide really um, let me know if you want me to do a better guide to this like actually showing you uh, where to get everything uh, splitting up some of the stuff um, like I said I'm not rarely an editor so this is just going to be uploaded raw so if you're watching this far and I do appreciate it that you watch this far and whatnot but I'm going to end it here that's my guide to making about 20 mil a day plus whatever else you do so if you're going out farming that adds on to whatever your 20 mil a day is and then depending on how much good feed you make and put on the marketplace you could be making about 20 mil to you know for example if you upload 3k you're going to be making 30 mil if you put up you know um if you upload 4 4k you'll be making 40 mil you know so it's pretty decent especially when all the ingredients are pretty much cheap you just go on the marketplace get your food uh your fish and then go to your fending place where you can go and buy mineral water and sugar and all that sort of stuff um and of course i'll show you again this is where the lambs are, the sheep, so you just come here and they're all literally around here, there's some up here but don't worry about them, just literally run around in this little circle here, by the time you've farmed one group but the next lot you've just, the other lot you just killed literally just respawned so, you, you know there's an abundance of sheep there, go out there with a um, shining um, butcher knife and you know that'll speed up by 10 seconds as well which is really good, um, and yeah Oh, and I would like to also add in, if you're in a guild, make sure you, you if, or be in a guild that gives you uh, some life skill, plus level 2 gathering, you know, that's just going to speed up your gathering a hell of a lot better, and that's, that'll give you level 5 gathering, um, and so yeah, I just wanted to share my way of making income, people may have way better ways than me, whether you make 40 mil a day, or 40 mil an hour, like I say, I don't grind, I make my income through life scaling. But I hope you enjoyed, and I'll end it here, and leave me some comments and feedback uh, in the comments of what you would like to see, and subscribe, I'll definitely be streaming some of this, maybe grinding, maybe I'll try and get some of the party members to grind, and yeah, I'll see you in my stream. Ciao for now.